All right, so we're part back to part two of our walkthrough for Black Ops 2. We just played the first part. If you haven't seen it, you can click on the link on the left-hand corner to go back to my previous chapter. Or if you've already seen this one and you want to go to part three, click on the link on the upper right-hand corner. And as always, if you like this video, and please click that like button and make comments. Hopefully they're good comments. So we just got the game and we're just playing it through. That's how it started. Her old man tries to kill Menendez. Menendez wants payback, even if it takes decades. Menendez, back then, is a, uh, a big fish in a small pond. He made his cake on the drug cartel out of Nicaragua. There's a hand-me-down. Mm -hmm. The CIA smoked his old man. Oh, Cyclops is pretty pissed at America. While we're fucking around in the Middle East, the Russians and the Chinese are getting real cozy. Huh. Now, the politicians, they want you to think this is about ideology. It's a lot of horse shit. Give me your phone. Go ahead. Rare Earth Elements. Whole fucking world runs on this shit. Who controls all of it? China. So while corporate America is kissing China's ass... Now the mysterious Cordis Diaz social network has crowdsourced simultaneous protests in both Iran and North Korea. Never seen in public, who really is the leader of Cordis Diaz? He's known only as Odysseus. Odysseus? My ass. <laughs> Raul fucking Menendez. Asshole. I told JSOC, but they were too busy. See, the drone race had started. I mean, really, guys? You're gonna build an entire military based on a mineral element that's wholly controlled by China? And you drink dipshit. No, oh, God. Give me a soda. Get it from the nurse's stash. And that diet crap. China's Premier Chen is outraged by Cortez Diaz's leaked memo, alleging the cyber attack was covertly ordered by the White House. And through all the dirty shit the U.S. government's gotten away with, this time, they're innocent, and no one fucking believes them. They take out Cortez Diaz's network. Two days later, the director of the FBI burns alive. Right now, a billion people believe that Raul Menendez is their savior. Well, guess what, boys? He's not. You better take him out pretty fucking quick. That shit's gonna happen. And then there's got a whole private fucking army hidden out there. Cubans, elite rank, state-of-the-art tech. How many followers does Cortez Diaz have right now? What, a billion people? Try two billion. You'll never believe their leader's a terrorist. They think Menendez is their savior. They've got a hell of a disappointment coming. That's all I can say. Time to go see what Menendez has got hidden down there. You ready, Harper? Keep momentum on the swing. I want to be left tank. So far, so good. Ready? Okay, hot shot, your turn. One more time. Let's go. the 
rope, cut the rope, cut the rope, cut the rope, cut! You okay? Yeah, we're okay. Thanks to you. Wide open. A little more of this gun, the crew. Walk in the park. No seas idiota. Do not underestimate Raul Menendez. Those gloves remind me of the gloves that uh, Tom Cruise used in Mission Impossible Ghost exactly. Protocol. It's left. And he was climbing uh, along the Burj windows. Sounds like something novel. That's what Menendez wants his followers to believe. Trust me, it isn't. Crosby, you're up. Alright, time to become a squirrel. You got the left side? Cover! Ready on your go! This is Harper. Come in. Enemies preparing to leave location. Advise. We need firm intel on the capabilities. You are clear to engage. Ready to move on my kill. An EMP grenade will fry their cloaking systems.
got to be more to this facility underground. Kraken, this is section. Surface installation is neutralized. Moving to investigate secondary structure. Just blowing. Stand back. Watch your step. Floodwaters may have weakened the structure. Holy shit! Look at this! What we saw up top was just a front. Walls are several meters thick. We lose comms inside. Update Briggs. Tell them we're moving in. Dragon, this is Harper. Confirming SciTech installation beneath the temple. Requesting immediate cleanup and containment unit to our location. Be advised, we will lose comms as soon as we make our entry. Kraken confirms. Ground team moving for immediate insertion. Stand by for ETA. Salazar, get it open. Enemy's optic systems. We need to get our techs working on analysis. Nice. Maybe now you should shoot up. I'll barely see you.
Okay, we're clear. This is 3D fabrication tech. Weapons, components, armor. Menendez is arming himself for war. The witch told us how much wealth Menendez built over the years. He's been investing in weapons tech. Somebody's here. Good. I got my own little RPG too. Let's see what we got hidden in here. Please, don't hurt me, okay? Come on out. This lab is linked to a known terrorist. You start talking or I will hurt you. My name is Eric Diner. I'm a magnetometrist. Yeah? And what is uh, Menendez's interest in you, buddy? They brought me here to process the solarium. It's a new, rare earth element that will render all existing microchip technologies obsolete. They're coming. Get me out of here alive. I'll give you everything. Down. requires two operators. On your go. Follow me! This single device has more processing power than your entire military infrastructure. Rumors around the lab were that Menendez plans to use it as a basis for a massive cyber attack. I, I heard talk of something called Karma. It may be the, the name for the cyber weapon. If Menendez uses a solarium worm to initiate an attack, there will be nothing anyone can do to stop it. Support team! Behind us! We got incoming! Crack it! Harper requesting confirmation on extraction TCTA! Uh, defensive positions! Crack it! Come in! Damn it! No response! We'll fight our way out, with or without support! This ain't over yet!
Captain, your team can stand out. It's Briggs! Stand out! It's the extraction team! Boy, are you a sight for sore eyes. I guess we can call this mission accomplished. Admiral Briggs, good to see you. You too, Sergeant. Whatever Menendez is planning, Solarium is the key to it. He's just a man, Admiral. He'd like you to think he's something more. But he ain't nothing but a sad old pitiful excuse of a man. I can't figure out Menendez without getting inside his fucking head. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua during his rise to power. You know his legends better than anyone. Tell me, why does he hate us so much? Tu primera guerra fría. As a boy, he witnessed the country's rape and murder his people. In 1972, there was a colossal earthquake. His family lost everything. A year later, the only thing he ever loved his sister Josefina was crippled in a fire. Raul and his father started over, sold drugs for easy money. They became rich, powerful legends of Managua. The Menendez cartel was all but untouchable, so the CIA took out Raul's father in a U.S. sanctioned assassination. Right, so now Menendez fucking hated America and started running guns in Afghanistan for his own private army. CIA got wind of it, went on a hunt for him in Kabul. That was the photo Wood showed us in the vault, remember? See that handsome bastard? That's me. The only one's your father. After Nam. The numbers and all that? I mean, he was one dangerous son of a bitch. <laughs> What'd you see, Woods? Sand. There's sand and more fucking sand. Hudson's contact's on his way. You reckon we can trust the Chinese? We can't hear. They've been supporting the Mujahideen, same as us. You know, if Russian was in Afghanistan, they'd look at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me. I don't like anyone. You might want to get your head down. Take it easy, Sal! Deliver the weapons. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. He can help you find Raul Menendez. We have fresh horses. You will follow. Oh shit. Let's do it. Mason, it's Hudson. Did you make contact with Jiao? We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. Alright, well, stop the video for here and we'll continue on with part three. So, stay tuned.